Hi everyone, I'm mixing things up for today's video. I am focusing on fall today. Crossroads Country Mall has so much decor and I know that there is lots of things in here that can be incorporated in your fall decorating. Not necessarily just pumpkins or scarecrows, but pieces that are fall colors. And I am searching for traditional fall colored pieces because that's what I love. And I love to incorporate these colors throughout my home all through the season, but especially at fall. Today, I'm not, spot, I'm not spotlighting just one specific vendor today. I am going through both floors today and I am in search of pieces that can be incorporated with fall decorating. And then at the end of this video, I will create a display. I won't be using all of the pieces because I know that I am going to find a ton of stuff in here, but I will create a fall vignette at the end of this video. And I will also mention what vendor has the pieces that I'm showing, just in case you want to stop over and see if you can find that piece, because I know I'm going to give you lots of great ideas today. Maybe some of these you never thought of incorporating with your fall decorating, but I'm definitely going to give you lots of inspiration today. So let's head inside and see what I can find. Before I get started, I would love to share a picture with you. This is Linda, the owner of the Crossroads Country Mall, and now you can put a face to the Crossroads. This picture was taken by one of the other vendors at the Crossroads, so I'd love to give a big shout out to Judy for taking this picture and sending it to me. Fall decorating isn't just about adding pumpkins and scarecrows to your decor. You can achieve the look by adding decor pieces that are fall colors. As I go along, I'm going to give you ideas on how you could decorate with these pieces if you had them in your home. We love our pictures for displaying floral arrangements, but how about trying something new? How about trying some dried cattails thistle, or even some dried tree branches that still have the dried leaves attached. These little owl would look adorable sitting on a windowsill beside a tea light. You could also add some Indian corn to complete the look. Have you ever tried placing a table runner or placemat on a surface that's not just your table? Try it. You just might love the look. They can be used on any furniture surface. I use placemats on my coffee table and end tables in place of doilies, and I've also used table runners to decorate an old rocking chair and also in my laundry room to cover the top of my shelf above my washer and dryer. Colored bowls are a great way to add a pop of seasonal color to your decorating. If you really want to dress up the bowls, you could add some gourds, seasonal fruit or vegetables. You could also fold up a few pretty tea towels and place them inside. Adding wooden crates and baskets are a great way to add a rustic farmhouse touch to your decor. A bowl like this would look wonderful filled with willow balls or pine cone. Did you know that you don't just have to use sweet little decorative houses in a village. Even if you only have one or two little decorative houses, they can be displayed beautifully in a vignette with complementing pieces. This vendor did a great job at showing how you can display different pumpkins. Notice how she alternated the patterns. Blankets, quilts, and textiles are a great way to add a pop of color and texture to your decorating. They can be draped over furniture, folded and placed on a chair. They can be also folded and stacked in a jelly cabinet or ice box. You can roll them or fold them and tuck them into a pretty basket or box. I love adding copper to my fall decorating. It's a great way to add warmth to your decor. These candle stands would work in so many areas of your home, but I can envision them on a dining room table or a fireplace mantle. 
decorative plates can really dress up a hutch, curio, or shelf. This tea set would look beautiful placed on a hutch, buffet, or dining room table. I think this little piece would work wonderful as a matchstick holder. This is a gorgeous set and I believe the fruit on here is oranges and lemons, but don't these colors just scream fall? Little birds like this would be great to incorporate with fall decorating. Decorative bowls like this work in any style of decorating. If you're a lover of antique and vintage toys, don't be afraid to incorporate them with your fall decorating. Their colors are wonderful. This framed chicken wire would be a great element to add in with fall decorating. It would also make a great piece to repurpose. Imagine taking a beautiful large sconce and attaching it and hanging it on the wall. That would make a great statement piece. These little pots would look nice displayed on a hutch. Try adding some yarn balls or thread spools to a basket. It's a great way to add color to your decor. You can find yarn and thread here at the Crossroads Country Mall. Small pumpkins and gourds make great basket and bowl fillers. You can also add a cloche to a decorative stand or cake stand. You could add a beautiful vignette inside the cloche or also use faux food. Lighting helps to create a beautiful ambiance. Place a crock on a shelf or incorporate in a vignette. A copper vase would look beautiful with dried flowers. Copper molds are a great way to dress up your walls for fall. Try adding wood items to your decor. The grain of the wood has a stunning appearance and it helps add texture. Try adding bird or animal figurines to a vignette. Books add a comfortable lived-in feel to your home and they also make great risers. Pictures of a fall scene or that include autumn colors are a great way to add visual interest and a conversation piece. Try adding a few glass bottles or vases to a windowsill. They're great light catchers. There are many beautiful pictures here that could be incorporated with fall decorating. This framed piece of an antique quilt is beautiful and it was a fantastic idea. This would also work well to do with a vintage tablecloth. Pictures are a great way to set the scene when decorating a room. It's more pleasing to the eye if the pictures complement the decor. Look at the autumn colors in this vintage shelf. It's beautiful. A few things to hang from this would be an apron, kitchen utensils, cookie cutter, apron, a small basket. Add fall charm to your home by incorporating pictures, plates, pillows, or figurines of turkey, duck, and pheasant. Try creating a floral arrangement using a beautiful autumn colored vessel. Okay, try and envision this with me. Take this duck and place it on a tabletop. Add a vase of cattails beside it. A few books are going to be used as a riser and place a candle in a copper candle holder on top of that. I think that would be a beautiful vignette for autumn. Dress up your table with autumn colored glass. This canister would look great on a countertop baker's rack or dry sink. Look at the autumn colors in this quilt. The beads also add a touch of elegance. Rugs are a quick and easy way to add fall color to any room. Dress up your sofa, chairs, or bed with autumn pillows. This bronze colored vessel would look beautiful with a few stalks of wheat added. You can create autumn vignettes on a vintage tray. Teapots look great in lots of areas, especially a hutch or above your kitchen cupboard. Seasonal coasters 
not only add charm, but they protect your furniture. Decorative tins also make great risers. Do you set up a coffee bar in your home? Something like this would work great holding stirs. Add rustic primitive charm to your fireplace mantle or hearth by incorporating an antique smudge pot. This would look wonderful hanging on a porch. You could incorporate a few bales of hay, pumpkin, a scarecrow, some Indian corn, a crow. The possibilities are endless. These mugs and candle holders would be beautiful in a fall tablescape. Try adding a vintage handle to your autumn vignette. I bet you'll love the look. If you're looking for inspiration on how you can incorporate handles into a vignette, I actually created a vignette using handles here at the Crossroads Country Mall, and I'll link that video below in my description box. Look at their little acorn hats. They're so cute. This would look adorable sitting on a shelf. Autumn colors are my favorite, and I incorporate them throughout my home the whole year through. Do you have glass doors on your cupboards or hutch? If you do, try adding seasonal colored bakeware and dishes. This would look great on a bookshelf or mantle. Autumn colored tins would look great added to a baker's rack or shelf. These autumn colored bakeware pieces would look beautiful tucked in behind glass cupboard doors. Decorate your island countertop or three-tier tray with salt shakers, hot pads, and trivets. These vintage tins are great examples to incorporate in the autumn kitchen. These autumn tablecloths, table runner, and apron would work in so many different areas, not just on a tabletop. They can also be incorporated on a dresser, on a vanity, on end tables, coffee table, armoire. Don't feel like you only have to use a table runner or tablecloth on your tabletop. The possibilities are so many. Wine corks are great for DIYs and bowl filler. Do you have a corn pan like this? Maybe you want one, but you just don't know how you would decorate with it. Envision this idea. Try tying a bow made of either gingham, cheesecloth, twine, jute, tie a little ribbon around that, tuck a few dried flowers or stems down inside. You could even add a few vintage kitchen utensils or a teeny tiny little cookbook and you could hang it on a wall. That would be so adorable. Vintage oil cans look great sitting on a shelf. When I'm out thrifting and antiquing, I start by looking for specific colors. I feel like over the years, I've trained my eyes to automatically spot particular colors. I use the same color palette throughout my home. So that's really helpful because it allows me to move my pieces around from room to room. I might have a piece that I use in my living room, but then I might decide at a later time that I want to incorporate that in my mudroom or laundry room. You won't see bright flashy colors or pastels in my home. Not that they're not beautiful, they are. They just don't fit in with my color palette. Decorate your laundry room for autumn by adding vintage clothespins to your display. Stackable nesting boxes look great tucked in a corner. Add vintage spools to a shelf, doble, or basket. These would work well in a fall tablescape. Antique sewing boxes would also work great in laundry room decor. 
If this is your first time visiting my channel, I would just like to let you know that I do a weekly series at the Crossroads Country Mall where I do a vendor spotlight, a different vendor every week, and I create a beautiful display using only that vendor's items. I'll link my playlist below in my description box. Add a fall flag to your garden. Try hanging a sweet little autumn colored purse on a coat rack. You could also tuck in a few wisps of dried flowers. You could place a fall colored hat on a mannequin head and set it on a vanity or dressing table. That would look sweet. Vintage suitcases can also be used as a stand and work great in autumn decorating. And of course, you can never go wrong with rooster decor, no matter what the season is. This vintage hat would look beautiful on the mannequin head that I showed you a little while ago. And this would look so beautiful on a vanity or dressing table. These candle stands are gorgeous and they're all the colors of autumn. Look at this primitive dough bowl. Oh, it's so beautiful. I can just envision a gorgeous fall vignette inside this. Oh, it's just beautiful. Try adding a few vintage pipes to your autumn decorating. Red garlands look great 
draped across a fireplace mantle, but they also look great on a tree with decorative lighting, above a windowsill, tucked inside of a box. There's so many possibilities. These decorative brass plates pair perfectly with fall decor. Vintage sewing machine drawers can be used the same way as a decorative bowl or dough bowl. Here's a beautiful painting with lots of fall inspiration. The pair of Pilgrim would also work as a doorstop. Try creating a autumn vignette in a vintage cradle. You could add a small quilt, a vintage doll, a teddy bear, a scarecrow, pumpkins, gourds, Indian corn, ornamental flowers, wheat, a clock, books, a crow. The possibilities are endless. These would look great on a fall bar cart. I'm not sure exactly what this is, but I like it. And figurines and vintage pictures work fantastic with autumn decorating. These little kitties are adorable and would look so nice tucked on a shelf beside a pumpkin. When you're decorating, think outside the box. Challenge yourself. Try incorporating something in your decor that you normally wouldn't. This sign has all the right colors for fall and it would look great on a shelf or above your kitchen cupboards. Vintage scales are a functional piece and they can be used in your home throughout the seasons. Check out these four antique chairs. They are beautiful and in great condition. They would look wonderful at a table, but they could also be repurposed. This vinyl album bowl is so unique. This could be decorated as you would any other bowl, but you could also add a battery operated pillar candle and place that inside. That would look great. Country malls and antique stores are great places to find unique decor to add to your home.
Vintage pans are great when making faux food. This picture and the next are both beautiful and would look wonderful incorporated with fall decor. This scarecrow quilt is adorable. I envision it being hung or draped over a sofa or chair. These two vintage suitcase look perfect together. These candle stands would look beautiful on a fireplace mantle or dining room table. Autumn is apple picking season and apples are great to incorporate with fall decorating. Isn't this apple shaped clock adorable? You can fill this apple egg basket with eggs to decorate your kitchen counter for fall. These leaf plates are adorable and perfect for fall decorating. They would also look really nice in a plate rack. These vintage Tupperware canisters are beautiful and they're perfectly colored to tie in with fall decorating. Don't feel that you can only use your canisters in your kitchen or dining room. They would also work great in your laundry room decor. Both of these glass dish sets would look gorgeous in fall tablescapes. These bronzed baby shoes would also work great as bookends. Here's an idea for thinking outside the box. This antique thermos could be repurposed to hold beautiful floral arrangement for fall. Brass candlesticks can complement your dining room table, buffet, hutch, entertainment center, so many areas in your home for fall. Dress up your kitchen walls this fall with these vintage copper molds. Old bed springs like these are great for holding wine bottles and candles. Burlap and burlap bags are one of my must-haves that I'm always looking for when I'm thrifting. These would look great paired with that vinyl album bowl sitting beside a record player. And here's the
the display that I made today. As you'll notice, there's not one specific piece that is just fall related. I chose to do that because I wanted to show you that you can still achieve the autumn look by using autumn colors. The ceramic pair adds dimension and charm and it also softens the look. I placed a single bud vase on the left and a decorative bowl on the right to balance out my display. The picture is my statement piece and focal point. I hope I was able to inspire you with this video today. Thanks for watching.